This Thanksgiving has special meaning for some wildfire survivors in the North Bay. They suffered through one of the worst disasters in Bay Area history. But KPIX 5's Andrea Borba shows us tonight they had reason to give thanks. In the kitchen at Frank Hetty's in Santa Rosa, this year Thanksgiving is not a holiday to step away from the industrial oven and skillet. We we were all affected by it. The restaurant sits a mile from Santa Rosa's Coffee Park neighborhood. Owner and chef John wanted to give back, but wasn't sure how or who would show up. Just decided, let's just host this whole thing, just because this is what feels right. So 600 pounds of turkey later and ham and salads and of course dessert, Frank Hetty's opened their doors for free to first responders and anyone who lost their home in the wine country firestorms. Many of the ingredients were donated, as well as time. Even the volunteers, they, they keep calling on the phone, yeah, sure, come on down, you can help out. I don't know them all. They just want to help out. It's just nice to be able to see people whenever a lot of bad things have happened in the past month, to see them actually smile for a night. For Hildegard Evans, who lost her home of 40 years just outside Coffee Park, this is a small slice of normalcy after the worst night of her life. 14 minute inferno. It's shocking. It's something you just can't digest. Inside Franchetti's was a chance for the homeless to commiserate and enjoy a Thanksgiving meal minus lumpy homemade potatoes. People are coming together like we've never seen before. It's, it's, it's a miracle. It's a miracle in this tragedy. In Santa Rosa and around wine country, that grand Thanksgiving tradition of counting your blessings holds a deeper meaning than the pat truism so often spouted at the table. I'm very thankful for community today. I'm very thankful that I got out alive. I'm thankful my husband yelled at me, get out, get out, get out over the phone. The spirit of giving back and sharing what you have isn't just a platitude here. What are you thankful for today? That. That's what I'm thankful for. The opportunity. That's it. That's what I'm thankful for. In Santa Rosa, Andrea Borba, KPIX 5.